Hey guys, Nyalbakor8 here with the brand new Splatoon 3 Switch OLED. Um, I've been really excited about this actually. Um, I barely managed to get my hands on one. We only got on the website last night when it came pre-orderable and we ordered one. But then it turns out we went to go look at the stores just to double check and see they might have some, you know, but we had heard they were all sold out. Um, we found this, so we canceled the other order and I have it in my hands now. Um, I've been super excited about Splatoon 3, and I cannot wait for September 9th. I can't believe it's only a few weeks away. So, looking at the box as I spin it around like this, there's a lot of it. I've got the promotional art for Splatoon 3 right here. Special edition. You know, there's the console itself. It says OLED. And got that graffiti running all the way down the sides and those ink splats, even some of the scratches and like worn off, you know, for chaos. <laughs> and then again, more console shots in the back. So uh, let's go ahead and take a look at the actual system itself. So I've had Splatoon 3 pre-ordered for a while now. And I'm definitely gonna make that in Minecraft, but I also might make a few videos just showing off Splatoon 3, cause Splatoon community has been waiting a long time for this game, and I think it might be a nice change of pace. Do a few videos on it. Depends though, we'll see. So, this is actually the second time unboxing it because I ran out of storage on the other uh, device, last phone I was using to record. So, I kind of opened at least the Joy Cons already in the system, but. Wow. Just look at the designs in this, like... Octoling. It doesn't really come off very well on the actual camera, but like, in person, it just looks so... It just looks pretty. And got the tentacles in the back. Kind of like how the actual, you know, tentacles of the octolings and inklings are. I love that. Here's the other Joy-Con we take a look at, the right one. Wow. Again, I love the designs and the graffiti of the phone here. It looks really good. You know the top half of them are the colors of Splatoon 3. But the bottom half are like a greenish, very light purple color. Um, kind of like that color set in Splatoon 1 actually. But. Now we're going to take a look at the actual console itself. And man... I already got a fingerprint on it. Oh, uh, I want to get rid of that. Anyways... You know, you got that widescreen uh, screen that the OLEDs have. Very small bezel on the sides. That's amazing, I love that. The back... Again, this doesn't look that great on camera. But in person, oh my gosh. This just looks actually really pretty. I like the design a lot. You, some people think it's kind of plain, but I think, personally... Oh, here's a good angle that shows it off well. I think, personally, it looks really good. You know... I'm gonna sit this right over here. Now I'm gonna take a look further into the box. I'll take out the cords, because, you know, you got your HDMI cord that connects the console and the dock to the TV. Basic stuff. Another charging cable. This is like my sixth or seventh charging cable because I've lost a few of them a few times. Um, it's always nice to have another one of these, especially if somebody's picking up a new Switch for the first time. This is really nice. And in here, it's nice wrapping. We have the dock. And this is the kind of paper they use to package the 3DS. I remember from when I was uh, younger, they used this like plasticky, styrofoam feeling plastic. And wow. <laughs> Check that out. Oh, there we go. Yeah. I love this thing. HDMI, of course. 
I wonder if there's any designs in the inside. I doubt it, but... Oh, look at the squid. Wait. Let me get it. Pick it up. There we go. It's picking up now. I love this. I honestly do. I'm so ready for this game to come out. Only two more weeks. It's crazy to me. I've been playing since two came out, or a little bit before that. I had one, but I didn't play it a lot. And I'm just ready to go into a new era. And they didn't do anything with this, which is a little disappointing, but you know, it's a uh, at least it got everything else nice design in it, you know. Now, since we're here, we're gonna take a look at the actual system itself. Boot it up really quick. Alright. Let me just get reconfigured for a second. Oh no, myself. I don't want to see myself. Okay, we're gonna turn the screen on first. Let it light up, because I don't want myself to be in the picture. There you go, you can see my hands. That's good. Better than before. Alright, there we go. I need to attach the, the uh, sides on. I just wanted to show off the screen, you know. It really doesn't come up that well again on camera, but um, in person it's very bright compared to the other switches on screen. But anyway, um, that was just my unboxing of that. Uh, Platoon 3 Switch OLED. I know it's kind of a short video. And uh, tell me how I did for like a first um, actually physical video besides something for Minecraft. Uh, did I do it okay? What can I improve on? I can improve on not putting my finger in the camera. <laughs> Anyways, uh, hope everybody else is excited for Splatoon 3. And I know I am. I'm really hyped. Yalbacore 8 out.